COVID-19 grant. Most significant change story. Ghana Society of the Physically Disabled, GSPD. COVID-19 dear, obe boy ye musiu pa, obe haya jin. Nana Udro Abrakwa the first, Odikro of Nyerede, Koforidia speaking. Sebi ye mpa ye jie mudi se ye bosi no, ni sun sasu e nya de kechua. Kampi mbise ye nya no mwa sebi omo di dem. Ti wamo di impact no, e affecti omo heavily. Omo entu mi mpie, e mkwa bonti, e ti e de hardship, pa e ba, Apostle Frederick Obri, pastor, reigning power gospel church, Goforidia, speaking. Yana Angini, Dakran of Paya Sorezo, no school, no market, nothing. Samuel Dungpo, Taylor and member. Ghana Society of the Physically Disabled speaking. Mia me pama dear say me for how be brimu will be in quas or be in quid will be in quay in poor abroad tarabaku the wapama a charge. I'll be a family member, I'll be a mina mere the head. Na a yede. Sanya, ya reanisha sen yet it wa my mind so. Gifty Uredu, trader and member, Ghana Society of the Physically Disabled speaking. So share TV so. And what's not ready? You know, to send a normal car on some now. No, if it's an army, so cross a maconi pem because what the TV want, yes, you are my man, so no, but she near teaching the power bottom, you got to not any no a year, no busia, or if you nipple pom a crowd for no book, or the Akatang and you won't any more. May you whom I am. When I saw those who have been affected with the virus, I become severe. Nancy Apia, teacher and member of Ghana Society of the Physically Disabled speaking. You see people, the way they have been wrapped and they are going to bury them. It's very sad. I started praying because I'm afraid. We encountered false issues about the COVID-19. That when you do this, do this, you are going to die. Eunice Owusu Anderson, President, Ghana Society of the Physically Disabled, Eastern Region speaking. Some of us, we get some false mentality. Ghana Society of the Physically Disabled is a non-governmental organization for persons with physical disabilities. And we aim to ensure the welfare of members. Dina Akua Mwabwating, Programs Manager, Ghana Society of the Physically Disabled speaking. We have branches in all the regions and we are more than 30,000 members. When COVID-19 came, we read that most of the information didn't go to persons with disabilities. So we thought it wise that if we are able to get access to funding to inform our members, to be able to understand the issue at hand, they will be able to cope with the situation. When we had the grant, we trained some of the members on peer counseling so that they'll be able to counsel their members who are physically disabled. We also did counseling sessions in the Kandisa Kwadi, Kumasi, and then Kofaludia. We did a three-day training. We gave them support, and then they organized counseling sessions for the members. They trained some of the disabled persons as counselors to go and then educate our entire society. It was me and a few people that had the opportunity to be educated. Felicity Ampom Semchre, member of Ghana Society of the Physically Disabled speaking. So we had to go from one organization to the other and we educated them on the COVID-19 so that they can be able to manage their lives and their businesses. Ya Didi, member of Ghana Society of the Physically Disabled speaking. Ah, yeah, say. We were taught how to use some of the PPEs, like the nose masks, the sanitizer, and others. How much did I say? Mritie bi me sa ohro wansa na o sanitizer wansa ne fe o she nose masks o ko bebi ni pa domwa esise o she o nose masks na o ko jina bebi ni pa no abodom bebi. Dilonjechi ni mono ma ehuna kenda mesono. 
a hunu a baffem. Yen penny for so, omni a dio for so a can boom. New ma and here I sit on the Omnica Council boy and Kakanaka, who she said, and memory covenant a coffin cra, a radaso, a crayum, a cono, a boy and debris. We have a record seventy four members who have been trained in peer counseling. For those who have been trained, they have been able to build their capacity on any pandemic apart from the COVID-19 that may arise in the future. Also, because they've been trained on counseling, they are also able to counsel members on other issues that may bother them. Persons with disability are the minority in the society, and therefore many at times our issues are overlooked. But for Ghana Somubi to pick us and train us, I think it's a plus for them, and we give them a thumbs up for that. Really, pa, I can say, I say it there. Na me boa, I say it there, pa. I'm a highlight here when you're my big brain. So I want to thank Ghana Somubi Jubedi very, 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 very much for educating us with those COVID-19 issues. We are grateful for uh, the Ghana Sumubi Jumadier support. Without your support, I don't know where our members will be now. We're giving them the capacity, we're giving them the information that they need. So we give thanks to the organizers, the donors, and everybody who has been part of this project. Special thanks. Ghana Society of the Physically Disabled, GSPD. Nana Odru Abrakwa the First, Apostle Obri Frederick, Dina Akuamwa Boating, Eunice Owusu Anderson, Felicity Ampomsemchre, Nancy Apia, Samuel Dunpo, Gifty Orudu, Ya Didi. Ghana Somubi Jumedie, funded by UK Aid from the British people. A vessel media production for Ghana Somubi Jumedie.